Hello and welcome to episode three of Mac Minute. This week we're going to talk about app switching, like getting around on the Mac and you have multiple programs that are open. Just like in Windows, there are some very quick ways to get around and there's some additional ways that the Mac provides that are much more visual and a little bit easier to use after you get used to them. Uh, the first thing I'm going to show you is, first of all, I've got all these apps that are open behind me and just a mess on my desktop, right? So the first thing I'm going to show you, just like a PC uh, on Windows, you can hold down the Alt key and hit Tab and you can go pick between your different applications that are running real quickly. On the Mac, you can do the same thing, except it's Command and Tab. And when you do that, you see the different applications come up just like this. You pick the one you want, let off, and then there's the application. You can do it again and say, I want to go over to Safari. There it is. So it's really quick. Hold on the Command key, hit Tab. Keep hitting Tab for as far as you want. The other thing you can do, and this is something a little bit beyond what we're talking about today, is if you're tabbing like this and you want to get out of the calendar, why it's highlighted, if you do Command Q, it'd get out of the application. That's what Command-Q quits an application and then it works right there as well. So the way that Apple would probably prefer you to do it is a new thing called Mission Control. And down at the bottom of your uh, bar, you have a thing called Mission Control. And you probably have on your keyboard a button for it. And if you don't, there's a gesture for it as well. Uh, if you go through the gestures, we're going we're to talk about gestures in a couple weeks. We'll go in more detail there. But I'm going to hit the gesture button that's on my keyboard and you'll see what happens. So now you see all my applications that are running. You see over here I have Notepad, and here I have Contacts, and here I have Calendar, and here I have Reminders. And I can simply just click on the one I want. Say I want Contacts, there's Contacts back up to the front. If I want to change, I can come over here and I can switch and click on Reminders. And then there's Reminders at the, at the beginning as well. So those are the two most popular ways of switching applications on the Mac. And like I said, the new thing is Mission Control. It is new, uh, I believe, in Lion. So it's been here for the last two versions of the Mac OS release, and that's the way they prefer. Now you will also see other things called Exposé, which it's hard to use now in the, in the mountain line. I think I can't really find it useful anymore not to have the, the control center. But Exposé also exists, and if you're using a little bit older version of the Mac and you don't have control center, look for Exposé. It does something very similar. It just doesn't show as much information on the screen. You'll notice that when I go in to Control Center. I have also at the top up here, I have Dashboard and Desktop, where Exposé doesn't have that. It doesn't give you that option. So there's just some additional things it provides to you over top of what Exposé did. Exposé is still great, and I do have a Mac that still has Exposé, and I do like using Exposé. But the with the new Control Center, it's or Commission Control, it it's kind of replaced it, so you don't really need to do that. So that's all we're going to talk about today. Again, I'm keeping it down to as close to a minute as possible, and that was fast app switching. Uh, next week, we're going to talk about something that just recently came up uh, as I was visiting my family members, uh, things that they're doing different on a Mac, and I know why they're doing it differently on a Mac. They just don't know any better because um, it works differently here than it does on a PC, and I'm going to talk about that next week because it can eat up your memory. So I think that's kind of an important one I'm going to throw in there. If you are watching us on YouTube, please subscribe to our channel. If you're watching us on uh, any kind of podcasting or something like that, be sure to subscribe, get updates. Visit the show page. We have our show notes on the show page. Many ways to contact us. We have Google Voice. We uh, have email. We have a Twitter. Uh, all kinds of things you can do to contact us, in addition to getting show notes. Plus, view our other shows. You can subscribe to the news list so you get updates. You can go uh, visit our community on Google Plus and get talking about other people about the Macs or any other of the shows that we have here. This show um, is broadcast live when we record it, but we don't have a, a specific recording day and time only because we fit it in between other shows that we do. And sometimes we record one or two at a time. Uh, and like today, I know I'm recording, uh, I think, just one today. I think we have one tomorrow I'm going to do as well. So uh, that's the special one that I just talked to you about, which you'll be able to see next week. So uh, please keep playing with it, Mac. Keep learning. Uh, have questions, please contact us. Uh, comments, especially love comments, feedback. Everything's awesome. Have a great week.